And now you got a problem with me! I'm not just gonna sit here and do nothing while you insult this man's ethnicity! I wasn't insulting him. Excuse me! Did you or did you not say that this man seemed tired? Yes, he's my friend. I said, Paolo, you look tired. Microaggression! Ah! 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 Persons of Hispanic backgrounds have been stereotyped as being sleepy and saying they look tired is a microaggression that will not stand! But I am tired. Oh, oh, ah. You! You're the new kid, right? I'm the principal of your school. My name is PC Principal. I was told you wanted to talk to me about some race issues. Okay, come at me. Come on, you want to learn about race, right? Give me your best shot. It's a nice day, isn't it? Mm, yes, very good. That was indeed not a microaggression. All right, round two. I ate a hamburger last week. All right, that was also not a microaggression. This time I will use a microaggression and you will see how it gives you a free shot. All right, everybody, listen up. I'm about to use a microaggression, but it's only for the use of training this young person in the ways of the social justice warrior. Thank you, microaggression, about to happen. Thank you. My friend Brian looks like a chick. Microaggression, hit him. Oh, oh. Not bad, kid, not bad at all. Not only is the word chick derogatory to females, but also criticizing a male for looking feminine is a microaggression towards person of transgender. Now let's see if you can spot a microaggression that's more subtle. My pants are warm. My pants are warm. That coffee belongs to Tim Sherman. I heard it's going to rain. Janet likes to roller skate. Mr. Yamashiro is actually a very good driver. Microaggression! Hit him! Nice kid, very nice indeed. Using the term actually inferred that maybe other Asian Americans are not good drivers. And the use of Mr. is offensive to persons of third gender. Now before we talk about your race, I need you to get out there and do some PC work for me. I'll let you know when I think you're ready. Remember kid, people use microaggressions every day. I'm counting on you to make them pay for doing so. A true warrior is understanding, non-biased, and is politically correct. You have potential, kid. I'm glad to have you in town. Now let's discuss your race and ethnicity. Let's determine exactly what you are. White. American. Race and ethnicity are very different things. Nice. It's your Manny Splendor journey. You see? That wasn't hard, was it? Now that you know how to define yourself, you can go back to making people pay for not identifying you and others correctly. I'm glad I know a little more about you, kid. Now get out there and kick some ass. Gosh, darn it, I don't think that vigilante's setting a good example for the young folks. 